Okay, my friends, I'm coming at you with a topic today that's it's kind of been heavy on my heart and mind here lately. And and as I've said before, I'm not a I'm not a certified therapist, counselor, psychologist, psychiatrist, and no certifications in any of those areas. But I love coming at you with with, with, with hard topics sometimes, just from an open heart and mind, and and, and just being really authentic with you. And, and this is a tough one. Now, I'll be honest, I don't know how this is going to turn out, but I'm going to give it my best shot. Our, our country is, here in the U.S., you know, it's, it's, been, ha it's been happening for years. And in, in, in many cases, this happens in all countries across, across the globe. But we have, we, we have mass shootings. We have the school shootings. And it hits me hard. And, and I want to try to make a difference. And... And like I say, if I can shoot one video, if, if I shoot a video and one person kind of wakes up and or, or, or maybe pays attention in a way, then it, it causes them to kind of tweak something they're doing. Because I lean on things that motivate me and get me to make change in my life in areas where I need to make change. And I think this is a topic that us as adults especially us as adults that are thinking about having kids, just had kids, or have kids that are aging, you know, that zero to 18 range. I have a nine-year-old son and a 13-year-old daughter. Okay, so let's, let's give this a shot. I'm a firm believer that something that can help dramatically is we need to make sure that we are raising our kids in a way to respect life in epic fashion. Have just an insane love and respect for all things living. And especially the human race and everything that that entails and respect the beauty of our life and the life of all of our, of our family members, our neighbors, the house over there and the house over there. Respect thy neighbor, respect everybody in this community of Cedar Park state of Texas, this country, and the entire planet. So extreme respect for, 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 for our fellow humans. Another thing, and this is, this is just my opinion, and I'm not backing this with any research, but it's my opinion. And I, I'd, I'd love to hear your thoughts on this. So, so I have a nine-year-old that love, nine-year-old son that loves video games. Um, Actually, let me back up for a second here. So I grew up in the country on a farm, and I, I grew up I grew up around guns, and I was I, I was taught extreme gun safety, extreme uh, extreme respect for guns and their their power, and and very specifically what they were to be used for, at least in the Culp House. <clears throat> I shouldn't say in the Culp house <laughs> on the Culp farm and and that was hunting if you were going to be feeding the family with that food I have a massive respect for for I was taught to have a massive respect for animals I'm not I don't my, for me personally I don't believe in hunting for sport um, if I was taught, if, if I was to, you know, if I, if I went out and shot a dove or a quail, we, 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 I was, I was, my family was into bird hunting. I, I still love bird, bird hunting with my dad or my father-in-law, but that was to feed us, that we would use that bird to, to nourish our bodies. Um, not a big fan of trophy hunting, not a fan of, you know, killing something so I can put take it to the taxidermy and hang it up on my wall. It's just not, I, I just have a, um, I mean, I, I have a, a love for, for, for all things, all things breathing, <laughs> all things that have a heartbeat, I guess you would say. And I, I was, my, my, true story, my, my grandfather, he, he was big on, you know, you, if, if you're gonna take an animal's life, it, it should be to nourish your body. And, I, and I'm a big believer that, you know, there's people eat animal products all the time. But I don't think they, I don't think that the the, the thought process goes through of, of 
of what happened to get that on your on your plate. And I, I have mad, I have I have big respect for that process. I was 